David Driscoll picked his kids up from Garen Elementary School in Brentwood this morning just after he had dropped them off. He is taking them home because they are not allowed in the classroom because they are not wearing masks. My kids don't want to wear masks. Um, they're not comfortable with them. Uh, they don't. They say that they can't breathe. Um, my oldest seven year old isn't asthmatic. He brings them without masks every day as a protest. Jill Schroeder is also against kids wearing masks at school. Her yeah. granddaughter now goes to private school because of the mask mandate in public schools. I would pick up my granddaughter from just being three hours in kindergarten and it was soaking wet, gross, and she would tell me the kids were picking them off the black top, putting them back on when they're playing. It's just not good. Their movement has a Facebook page, Unmask the Kids Brentwood. It has 454 members. They are asking parents to protest so administrators will allow kids to take off their masks at school. This issue is not exclusive to Brentwood. A protest against masks is scheduled for tomorrow in the San Ramon Valley Unified School District. The superintendent in Brentwood says this is not a decision for administrators. I'm an educator, not an epidemiologist, and our job is to follow the guidance from the scientists of the California Department of Public Health so we can keep our schools safe, and that's what we're going to do. He says he is following the mandates, but David Driscoll questions whether schools have to listen to state and federal health officials. It's not law. It is a mandate, so it's guidance. That's not what the state says. That's not what the health department says, and that's not what our attorneys say. They all say it's a law that we have to follow to have kids masked indoors.